Hello guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. We're back in the new iMovie updated 2013 version and uh, I'm going to be showing you how to work with text, how to work with titles and transitions and all of that good text goodness. So let's go ahead and jump into it. So the first thing that I'm going to show you is I'm going to show you exactly what a transition looks like there. Let me mute the sound. If I go right here, if you see this little space square grayish thing there and it uh, shows that it's one second long and then if I highlight over it it shows that is indeed the cube transition one of my favorites uh, in order to see that you'll just press play on the timeline there and then look in the upper right hand corner and boom there's a nice cube transition now you may be asking how do I add that now uh, all you need to do to add a transition in between two clips is down here in the lower left hand area of the screen you'll see transitions it is your first option there iMovie provides you with a plethora of options here you have anything from cross dissolve all the way to a ripple effect here so let's go ahead and add one let's add a mosaic transition so if you click and hold it highlights it yellow and then you can drag it down in between those two clips now once it is placed in your timeline you can do a number of things you can double click it and by doing that up here it brings up a few different options you can change the duration of that transition by highlighting that there and making it two seconds if you would like by doing it just like that uh, and then you can actually go over here and change the transition by clicking on this box here if indeed you realize the mosaic is hideous and you don't want to use it so you can edit it and once you are done just go ahead and click down below somewhere on the timeline and that will go ahead and add your adjustments go ahead and play it through on the timeline like I'm about to do now and there we go nice mosaic transition there and if you would like to remove a transition after you have added it you just select the little gray box there that represents the transition and then just press the delete key on your keyboard and that transition is no more I'm gonna go ahead and add it back just for the purposes of this video the next thing that I want to show you is some text and titles. So if you go down here to the same content library in the lower left hand side of your screen, the next option you will see is titles. Okay, click on that option there. Now you're going to see a few uh, boxes up here with some text in it. Now you can choose which one of these you want to use. So for a title, you may want to use this standard title here that zooms in uh, a little bit. So if you highlight over and drag the, the cursor there, it'll show you the animation that the text will have within your video you may want a nice title like this here or you may want a nice lower third that comes in very nicely like so or you may have a horror movie or something and you want it to have some lines or if we go on down here and you want to add some color or some you know jazz effect like this one here it kind of explodes uh, or some nice lights here uh, from the disco whatever you want to do uh, nice Star Wars credits effect here whatever it may be iMovie has it. So what you're going to do is you're going to select which one you want. I'll select this title screen here and click and hold, drag it down to where you want to place it within your video and then it will now be in your video. So if I double click on it there in the upper right hand corner it will let me add my text. So I'm going to go ahead and add iMovie tutorial title goes here this is awesome just like so and I now have some nice text within this box and then if I go down here I can actually play it on my timeline just like that and it zooms in and it looks epic just kidding anyways that's how you kind of edit it you double click it down here on the timeline and up here you'll see uh, what you're you know editing what can you know be changed what cannot uh, because it's a set option here you can't change the text but once you're done you can actually click this little checkbox here just like so and it now indeed is done so that's how you edit the text but let's say you want this title screen to last a little longer you can click and hold when you hover over the exterior of the box there and just drag that out so I want it to be about 15 seconds drag it out to about 15 seconds just like so and now that little title screen will last a little longer uh, if you do want it to there and let's say you want to move it around you can click and hold and move it anywhere you want on the timeline but I'm going to leave mine right where it is there and then if I want to I can always go to my transitions like I have shown you before and then I will go ahead and add the circle open transition like so 
show and if I play it on my timeline I'll have my nice text slide which then goes into my nice transition like that into the movie so guys I hope this video helped you out as far as working with text transition and all kind of good stuff like that if you do however have any questions please put those in the comment box below I get to those as quickly as possible and answer as many as I possibly can go ahead and hit that little thumbs up button down below it does help me and feed my dogs anyways guys I appreciate you watching this video and I will see you guys next time.